morning. Good morning. Today's your day. Today is going to be a good day. November, is it the 13th? 13th. 2015. 13th, yeah. <laughs> Friday? Oh, man. Knock oh, you picked a winner. Yeah. Wasting away again in Margarita. Those wheels actually don't look as bad as I thought they were going to. Did they take the oh no the pinstripes on there? They look like a little bit worse than you flip. No, they no they're not deep bones. Alright, we're on for the source, so when you're ready. Good morning. Good so morning. I'm in my 2002 M5. I'm gonna take it for a test drive. Hey it works. Hey it runs, look at that. So it looks like it's been started only once today. So yes, yeah, so I checked we do have, so it is a, a Mark III with a 161, so I don't know, so it's not, so we need to update that to version 62. 32. 32. I don't know if that'll run, just put a Mark IV in it. Oxvent, DSP, oh it's got telephone, that's why they're different hey. to mine. I'll be there shortly. Go. I forgot how lenient the clutch is. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we'll go left here. Go the same way I did. Into the ghetto. The Jacksonville ghetto. This guy here does a lot of work for Seamick. That's his M5. He had two cars that he did body work on. We're at Seamick. And we're written about really? Jalopnik. Yeah, I don't know if you saw the wide body or the Liberty Walk. Um... Hey, man. <laughs> you like music? <laughs> All right, guys, good morning. Uh, we're in Jacksonville, Florida. It's a perfect day. It's 75 and not a cloud in the sky. This is the time of year when Florida is just a peach. Although, that's, that's Georgia. Huh? Georgia. Hey! hey! Florida's on point. Though. Yeah, Florida's on point today. Uh, and so is this car. This is a 10102 build model year E39 M5, freshly owned by Kenan Wilson. Yeah. Oh man. Oh yeah. Titanium silver over 05 SW. Yep, 05 SW. Black, black interior sport, whale penis leather, sunshades, M audio. Um, doesn't do PDC, but it's M audio and, and split folds. Center console's out right now. We've pulled it out just to. Uh, Put it back together. It's actually coming apart. So we're gonna put it back together, but everything else in here is pretty much perfect We have tape box right now. We got some electronics upgrades to do. It's a stock shifter stock suspension and it's on uh, 19 inch kind of CSL inspired wheels. We don't know exactly what they are yet, but we'll find out uh, The tire setups different 255s in the front 285s in the back Bridgestone, Bridgestone what? The Tenzas. Uh, uh, summer performance. Uh, yeah, something like that. I don't remember what they are. So, I haven't, I was saying yesterday, I have not been out of an airport in Florida in 13 years. And uh, it's nice. We got palm trees and our blue skies and it's warm. So we're gonna enjoy that today, Friday. And uh, then tomorrow we have a long drive north. Hey! Look at that. Oh yes. Show them what a real V8 is. Exit 56 <laughs> <laughs> that one has more power. Doesn't even know what's next to it. Oh guys, there's a Bentley up there as well. Continental GT convertible, perhaps. All right, so after our lunch, we've come out here to the car, and uh, it's been in the sun. This side's been in the shade. So this side's been in the shade. It might be a little harder over here. Let's oh, yeah, see how right. Steven's doing. Harder? Yeah, a little bit. Pinstripe delete in the parking lot of uh, Four, Rivers? Four Rivers? Four Rivers in Jacksonville. Anything more specific than Jacksonville, or is it just Jacksonville? Oh, sucks. Okay, this side's gonna be harder. Maybe we'll have to flip the car around. Yeah, park the right side in the sun and try it again, but it looks way better without the pinstripe. And we're gonna have to get some uh, 
because it's clear, very, very it's clear where, where it was. <laughs> uh, yeah, we'll have to get some goo gone or something to get the adhesive off the clear, and then you'll you'll probably buff that anyways, and yeah, we'll it'll, do, it'll be good as new. We're gonna do paint correction in the spring. So. Yeah, yeah. So we'll oh my god! Sweet. Oh my god. Who's it be? Steven. Oh, it's the fun. Yo, Steven. Not much. Uh, we parked the car in the sun. We're, we're at Walmart peeling off the last of the pinstripe. <laughs> <board. laughs> so we've kind of found out that they are style 359 wheels or replicas. We don't know yet if they're real or not. Uh, style 359s were used on the uh, E90 M3. E87 1 Series M. Um, currently in the process of removing the pinstripe. So we peeled it off when it got hot in the sun. And now we're using um, Goof Off to spray onto the adhesive, let it sit in the sun for a few moments. I can't see what's in focus and what's not. And then just rub out with a towel. Not great for the clear, but it'll be getting full paint correction and wax and all that in the future. And it's worked quite well. Here's what it looked like before. There's some kids screaming over there. I hope he's hope he's still with us, but uh, that comes off actually quite easily. Down like that. From the in-car phone that was in the center console, we've taken the wiring out, a large amount of it. We've discovered that the previous owner has plastidip the phone black. So we're peeling it off to dispose its, expose its formal glory, former glory. Look at that. Yeah, silver. Show us the front. It's a retina display. <laughs> oh yeah. Full retina display. <laughs> Time, wait, does it say time port? Yep. That's what it is. Wow. Jeez. O2, great. baby. Hell yeah, <laughs> that's, technology from O2. That's, that's where it, it is. CPIA. What's our exact mileage right now? One, wait, let's five, see. Eight, eight, one, five. Uh, yeah. Like, what's that called? It's, what's, it's like the word race car. It's a, it's the same backwards as well. So much better. Now we'll have to charge it up. Most of these cars are five and six owner cars because they hand around, hand around, hand around. Hand around. This one's a two owner car, and um, it's pretty cool because the guy we got the car from. This is the guy. We had a yellow one for thirty that we sold. This one trade the car came here out of Arizona with this book, oh, wow. which is. The, these are the guys that sold the car new, original window sticker, and then everything that's ever been done to the car, all in chronological order. And the guy was so particular, he even made a table of contents that outlines. That's, that's exactly how we are. Yeah. Like very often. Yeah, because yeah, people take them off to jump the car because yep. that's where the battery can, and then they forget to put them on. And then... Is that, yeah, stock exhaust. Yeah, everything's yeah, stock, stock on this car. Yeah. 
had love of his historical. So, yeah, it's just, you know, it's easy for one of those to look like this because they're new. Yeah, you know, when you have a car that's 16 years old. So where did we just eat, Stephen? Uh, we ate at Bazil. Bazil, uh, I, I like to call it Bazinga. <laughs> I think that's more fun. There's some Maserati. Uh, it was very good. I, I had a margarita pizza. We had uh, some quick martinis. Is that an AMG S Class kind of? Um, I don't know. No, it's, it's an S550. It's an S550 with rims. 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 Deep dish rims. Um. Anyways, what's our time check right now? Uh, I guess I can't find that out. Not even nine o'clock yet. We're tired. We came in late. We got up early. Tomorrow, we're getting up even earlier. Hey, it's uh, Luke's dad. Uh, it's 6.50, Grand Coop. Um, tomorrow, we're getting up even earlier because we have a bit of a road trip from northern Florida to northern Ohio. Um, Woo! Yeah. Well, the good news is he's coming with, so we'll have some comic relief. <laughs> um, no, but it'll be fun. I, I've never done... I've done the drive from Florida to Ohio, but not the way we're going to go. Ooh, We've yeah. always taken the east. Oh, yeah. It's a 740i, not the LI. No, it's an IL. IL. IL Is it really? Wow. It didn't look like the long wheelbase. That's, a nice one. That's beautiful. Yeah, <laughs> that was sexy. All right, well, we're going back to Steven's place now, and then road trip tomorrow. <laughs> All right, guys, so the end to a very long day. Obviously, I got the M5, and I am incredibly happy with it. Ryan is taking a shower, um, so I'm just out here filming an ending clip. It does need some things. Uh, we definitely noticed some stuff in the drive line needs to be addressed. Uh, namely, it's just, it sounds like it's just CSB rattle to me, and then uh, possibly a Jubo. Uh, we hear a little bit of noise, and you can tell it's definitely something in the drive line because when you drop from third to second, the noise speeds up, so I'm imagining that's what it is. Um, um, again, cosmetically, it does not need very much at all. We got that stupid pinstripe off of it, and it looks a lot better. Steven's very happy that that's gone. <laughs> very happy that was gone. Um, so I did notice there's some clear peel a little bit here in the mirror and a little tiny spot here on the hood uh, as well. And as for these wheels, uh, they're not OEM BMW wheels, but they are replicas of an OEM BMW wheel, and that came on the 1 Series M. So I'm going to try and sell those and then get some a square set of Style 65s uh, just for the winter. Um, and I know that's painful to hear that, oh god, he's going to drive his M5 through the winter, but don't worry, I'm going to opti-coat those cars as soon as I get home. And then uh, my cousins have a jack, I'm going to put, or uh, a lift, I'm going to put it up in the air and 3M seal the entire underside uh, to prevent any rust. Um, it does uh, other mechanical things. I think uh, we checked... Oh, you can't see anything. We checked and the uh, CPS sensors are throwing a code, so I'm going to do those and the spark plugs while I'm in there. Um, and Luke is probably going to help me with that since he's done that on his M5. Um, so, but outside of that, cosmetically, there are a couple things that are too dense here. Um, a little, the only rust we could find on the car is in the gas cap a tiny bit, and then here uh, is bubbling up just a little bit, but I'll detail that more in another video. Um, so, yeah, the car is amazing. I'm happy with it. Again, thanks to Steven for putting <laughs> us up. Um, I, you know, again, I, I just can't believe that it happened. And, uh, I, you know, for all the people that, who have supported that dream and making it uh, and come true, you know, it, it's just, I just can't believe it. And it probably won't set in for a little while that that's actually my M5 sitting behind me. That's just, that's crazy. I've been watching a lot of videos lately about people buying their dream cars, and uh, I can check that one off the list. That's just crazy um but yeah it's been an awesome trip so far and i've got a long drive in front of us tomorrow yes we do uh, but uh it's gonna be a blast so thanks for watching guys uh, i'll talk to you in the next video